<laughs> hey everyone, I'm Scott Stokely and this is part one of my six part video diary for the Pro World Disc Golf Championships. I don't even try to read my diary. It has a special lock on it and it's under the mattress and like it's written in code. But I'm here and I'm going to be documenting the next six days, starting with today, the day before the tournament begins. Uh, first, real quick, uh, my tour series harps are available at scottstokely.net and there's tour series wizards, I think marbles and bergs signed. So go check those out. All right, you might have noticed in the thumbnail, I was holding up cake. Uh, one of them said 43 and one said 10. Uh, that's because it's my 53rd birthday today. Uh, the store ran out of fives. Uh, so I got two pieces of cake instead of one. And for those of you who are wondering, yes, I not only ate the cake, I ate both of them. <laughs> uh, it's the first cake I've eaten in a year, but it's my 53rd birthday and, uh, what a wild position to be in. I mean, my last world championships, I believe was 2001 or 2002. It's hard to tell that long ago. Uh, but, uh, it's been a wild journey. Y'all have been part of this for the past year. I mean, we've been building to the, to the season, but I've made no uh, secret of the fact that this is the event of the season. I mean, this is what I'm here for. Uh, I, I wanted to be in the best possible shape and have my game together. And it, it mostly is there. Um, I'll start off by saying I had a heck of a scare a couple days ago. If you were at my live stream that I do every Friday night. I had a runny nose and congestion and I was up all night sneezing and I was so scared. I don't need to explain why just the mere word will get me demonetized, but I was nervous. And uh, I woke up the, the Friday morning and I took a test and it was negative. And then I woke up on Saturday morning, the morning of mixed doubles, took a test again, it was negative. By the way, I even saved the tests. <laughs> See? Um, uh, just for this video. <laughs> now I can throw away these snotty pieces of cardboard. But um, yeah, it came out negative, but I had to make doubles on Saturday. I still, even though I had tested negative for a couple days in a row, I told all the people we were playing against that I wasn't feeling well and that I had a runny nose and uh, that I wouldn't be high-fiving anybody and I just stayed like 20 feet away from everybody. It was actually kind of funny. It was so hot. Everybody was like under the canopy in the shade. And I was like 20 feet away, uh, you know, out in the sun. But you can't be too careful, right? I mean, the, the idea that I would make someone sick, especially some young player who's out here with a chance to win the world championships, like, ah, uh, it was worth it. But anyways, I tested again. And then I went and got a different brand of test. And negative still. So I dodged that bullet. And by the way, this is not a pregnancy test. I've sent this picture to a couple people and they're like, is it a boy or a girl? It's like, stop it. Not a pregnancy test. All right, so we get to the World Championships and uh, God, like I said, I've worked really hard to get here and I'm really excited with where my game's at. I woke up this morning and this is, this is I swear it's not vanity. It's I'm still just, uh, is, I don't know if it even incredulous is the right word. But I woke up this morning, 53 years old, for the first time ever. I went and stood in front of a mirror, uh, undressed, tried to get the visual out of your head. <laughs> but I looked in the mirror and I went, damn, dude, you look like a professional athlete. Like, I was, like, really impressed because I've never felt this way my entire life where I actually just looked in the mirror and went, wow, you, like, you worked hard and it, and it shows. So I, my body's where it's supposed to be. Um, my practicing, all the practicing and training has been great. My last five tournaments, I've cashed at four of them. And, you know, that's not the goal to cash, but y'all have no idea how hard it is just to cash out here against these kids. They're so good. But I did. I cashed it four out of five. The ratings at my last five tournaments, 1,010, 1,009, 1,017, 1,016, and 1,024. So I've been playing solid golf. I've been trending upwards. I've been shooting well over 1,010 for the last couple months. Uh, 
my goal a year ago was to get up to 1,020. No dreams of being a 1040 player, but I thought 1,020 was what I could get to. That's the lofty goals. And I only came up uh, a, a little bit short of that. And I'm super proud of that. Now, can a thousand, you know, player who's shooting 1,010 to 1,020 rated golf win the world championships? Yeah, they can. Are they a long shot? <laughs> of course. Um, I'm a long shot. But I'm not a no shot. I, I'm going out there to win. I'm always playing to win. And I'm going to tee off the first hole of this tournament. Tied for first place with everyone else. And I'm in contention to win Worlds. And that is my goal. Uh, I don't have a backup plan for what... Uh, what I'll be shooting for if I have a bad first round that's not even on my radar. My plan is to have a great first round, make it onto lead card, sustain all week, and blow everyone's mind. That's all I'm thinking about. If that doesn't happen, I'll cross that bridge, and I'll be doing a diary every single day, and I'll talk about how my day went. But as of right now, I believe 100% that I'm going to succeed. And just i you know i know this is going to sound kind of sappy but all of you have been with me for the past year every single time you guys and gals have posted that you're supporting me or that i've inspired you or that you are following the journey it's it matters like i hear every one of those that's why i like every single comment because i want you to know that i took the time to read them so i'm going out tomorrow See if we can't just shock the world. Why not? Stranger things have happened. I think I can do it. And uh, I will be checking in every single day with updates. But other than that, I love you all. Let's go do this.